All right. Um, what's okay? So there's a little bit of a backstory for this. So there was a there was a it was a it wasn't a hurricane. It was a blizzard. It was a blizzard uh, a few months or in the winter, and we were supposed to play in uh, Philadelphia, uh, Pennsylvania. Uh, uh, and then we didn't because it got snowed out and we, we had a day off. So we were like, let's go to Pittsburgh because we all like legitimately love this town. I swear it's true. There's so much about this town that we love. But we were we just like, let's go spend our day off in Pittsburgh. So we did and then we did this, we did this thing that we've done a few times before. We go on our Twitter and we just put coordinates on a Twitter and see and like come here in 30 minutes. And we pick the most... Uh, like kind of disgusting and uh, least uh, vaulty place that we can find. So we picked a, a dumpster uh, near the Mexican war streets and we put in these coordinates and we were like, come, come see us play. And like, I think like 10 or, or 12 of you guys showed up. You did, I remember you. you. And then somebody brought a dog. And anyway, we, we, we put it on, we, we, someone taped, like, taped it, put it on their phone and then it became a thing. And then, and so that's what happened. And so, uh, like, 200 people saw us play at a dumpster over there or wherever. Yeah, I think it's over there. So anyway, so then there's a whole story. So then, and then somehow the, the mayor of, of Pittsburgh just decided to pile on. And he's like, he's like, you, this is all quoting. That's why I have to use it on my phone. It's like, you need to book a date, get back up here, and perform for more than 20 people and two dogs. Great video. Next time, indoors. And I was like, this is amazing, because I look, and he had a little check mark next to your name, and Twitter, that means you're like the actual mayor or whatever. So I wrote back, I love you, mayor of Pittsburgh. And then, and then, and then they announced that we were playing here uh, at this thing right here, and then the mayor again decided to pile on to Guster. He goes, that's right, this, t this time there will be more than 20 people, two dogs, and a dumpster. Welcome back, Guster. Which, hold on, I mean, just the fact that the, that, the, that the mayor of your city is just talking trash on Twitter kind of makes it already like twice as good of a city as it was 10 minutes before he did that. And then, so then I say, I was like, I tweeted back at him because now we're just in it, you know what I mean? And the whole world's watching, you know, Guster and the mayor of Pittsburgh. Uh, he's like, I wrote back, I was like, you're singing a song with us, Padudo, you got to, we can even so sing about dumpsters, let's do it, I'm serious. And then he wrote back right away, you write a song about Pittsburgh, dogs, snowstorms, alleys, and dumpster, and I will sing with you. So. So like 30 minutes ago, we wrote a song. <laughs> I think I remember how to do this. Okay, so literally we wrote these like 30 minutes ago. Uh, so I can make no promises because the, the mayor was running late. So we haven't run anything. We don't really know what we're gonna doing. But we did write a, a song and uh, we, the chorus goes like this. Pittsburgh, dogs, snowstorms, alleys and dumpsters. I swear, because we didn't have a lot of time. And I was like, well, we kind of already started it for us. So if the mayor's here, you get a co-write on this one. So. We're just gonna do our best and play uh, a, the once, the once and only time we're gonna play a song about Pittsburgh, inspired by your amazingly socially uh, apt mayor, Mayor Bill Peduto. <laughs> near the Mexican War Streets, Pittsburgh, dogs, dumpsters, alleys, and dumpsters. Pittsburgh, dogs, snowstorms, alleys, and dumpsters. Our B minor to E. We went down to Randy Land. We spent too much time with that man. And then we tweeted to all of our pallies. Come watch the Guster sing it in an alley. Pittsburgh, dumpsters, dogs, snowstorms, and dumpsters. Live 
lives in Squirrel Hill. It's a little yuppie, but we like it still. You got some churches you could put the Pope in. Pull up your zipper, Kenny Woods open. Pittsburgh, Dundas, Dundas, Dallas, Dusters. take you back to a land and a time far, far away before there was ever any HBK line. A time before there was ugly vinyl signs littering our beautiful green hillsides. A time called January when a group of minstrels were traveling across the country looking for a haven to save them from a nor'easter that was roaring up the coast. And they found this haven where they sought love and music and culture that flowed like the three rivers that go through their beautiful land. And they found themselves in the north side of the historic area of Allegheny City, where they set up shop to have a concert next to a dumpster with 20 people and two dogs. And they made a promise that one day they would return to that sacred land and perform again when the beautiful spring sky would allow more Thank you so much. That was awesome. That, that was the whole reason we decided to play here again for that moment. But we'll play a few more. Thank you, Mayor Peduto. That was fantastic. Okay, a few more.